Now, young patients at Brisbane's <laughs> latest Salento Children's Hospital Perplexed. have been given an early taste of this year's Royal Brisbane show, or the ECA, as it's known. And with many of the kids, of course, unable to get out and about, the show came to them. Fantastic move. Casey Briggs reports. A chance to enjoy the annual festival. Yay! With sideshows, animals and face painting. <laughs> it's a welcome change for the young patients going through a tough time being told you have to lay still and not move for days at a time, it, it's heartbreaking to watch. And then you come to days like this and you get to see them smile. Preston recently had a kidney transplant and says today was a nice distraction. Oh, I'm looking forward to do everything. Sienna has been in the oncology ward since August last year. Experiencing the interaction with other kids and, you know, the echo atmosphere, which she wouldn't be able to go to and I wouldn't take her. From the RNA's point of view, it's the least we can do to uh, give these kids uh, a little bit of joy. For the kids who can't get to the ECHA, it's just a, a lovely thing for them to do, to be distracted and entertained. Bedbound hey. patients weren't left out, with show bags delivered to their wards. The baby animals here are a highlight for the young patients, but for the rest of us, there's only a couple of days until we can get our hands on these guys. The show kicks off on Friday. Casey Briggs, ABC News. Lots of action going on there. There was what the chook or the turkey on his knee. Just see the goat <laughs> pulling Casey's suit jacket. I missed the goat bit. Tearing sorry. it apart. <laughs> the things you do to but get the, the, the piece to camera. The chook on the lap is pretty good. Yes, yeah, fantastic. It wasn't bad.